North Oaks is a private community. It was uh, started uh, uh, by the Hill family, and uh, Louis Hill designed this place to be uh, to provide larger lots and homes and uh, a lot of privacy. Um, over the time that I've been living in North Oaks, it was clear to me that we had a higher percentage of uh, tick-borne illness than in adjacent communities, and a lot of it has to do with just the natural uh, surroundings that we have in our community. There's a lot of trails, a lot of forest, um, and certainly opportunities for uh, tick to proliferate. Uh, in 2015, there were many concerned residents in North Oaks that were being diagnosed with primarily Lyme disease, but other tick-borne illnesses as well. And the City Council recognized that there was growing concern, so they held a meeting and asked all concerned residents to attend. We were fortunate in that one of the individuals that stepped forward in that first public meeting was Dr. Brooke Moore, and she shared what her experience was with her family. The reason I attended that meeting for residents was that since moving to North Oaks in 2009, my husband had been diagnosed with Lyme disease, and our dog had also been diagnosed with Lyme disease. And with my background, both as a physician, but also with training in public health, I was interested in what could be done to decrease disease here in North Oaks. The city of North Oaks is a unique um, community. It's a, it's a private city. Uh, we're represented by a homeowners association as well as the city council. The two entities have to work together, especially as we embarked on this ambitious uh, program to uh, help control tick-borne illness. I really wanted the association to make sure that it's doing its due diligence and responsibility to manage uh, the problem. When new people move in, we send them a welcome packet, and part of that welcome packet really talks about ticks, tick mitigation. When people come into the office, we have lots of um, educational pamphlets. Um, using SurveyMonkey, we sent out an uh, email with a link to the community and collected data on what was happening. When the Tick Task Force was formed, the rates of Lyme disease in North Oaks were two to five times uh, the surrounding community rates. And uh, we use that data as part of our monitoring. And currently, the rates in North Oaks have declined uh, compared to when the task force was formed. We joined the task force because uh, we were all very concerned about the presence of Lyme disease. The Tick Task Force, put together beautifully by Brooke and Rick, uh, was the real answer to that solution. The, the reality is, is that we can't eliminate the risk of tick-borne illness, but what we can do is manage and mitigate. And I think our program here has demonstrated that we've been able to do it very effectively with this integrated pest management program that we've put in place, and I think it's something that other cities can adopt as well.